be fully alive is to be able to move. Movement allows us to enjoy life and be everything we were meant to be. This movement is made possible by the bones, muscles, and ligaments of the body. These tissues respond to the commands of the nervous system and allow us to walk, run, bend, twist, lift, and do other normal body movements. A key structure permitting these movements is the spinal column. The 24 interlocking bones of the spine are designed to allow movement while protecting the vital nerve pathways of the spinal cord. The relationship between the nervous system and the bones of the spine is critical to good health. Here's why. The nervous system, consisting of the brain, spinal cord, nerve roots, and all the nerves of the body, control the function of virtually every cell, tissue, organ, and system of your body. If the nervous system malfunctions, the organs and tissues they control malfunction. And since the bones protecting the spinal cord are movable, they are a common source of nervous system interference. While you may have consulted this office because of an ache, pain, or other health complaint, your doctor of chiropractic doesn't treat aches or pains. Your doctor locates and treats nervous system interferences, usually along the spine. When areas of your spine not moving properly are located and nervous system interferences are reduced, patients discover pain relief and an improvement in their overall health. Finding these areas of your spine interfering with your nervous system is the purpose of a thorough examination. Since your spine is designed to move, an improper movement can interfere with your nervous system. X-ray films were taken as you went through normal ranges of motion. These films show you and your doctor how well your spine is working. When standing normally, looking straight ahead, and supporting the weight of your body equally on both feet, your cervical spine should look something like this. This is the chin, and your shoulders are down here. These white dots are the spinous processes that make the bumps you feel up and down your spine. Powerful muscles attach to these levers to help support the spine. Notice they are centered and in proper alignment. Yet there is a problem with this spine. Watch. When you bend this area of your spine, to your left, the spinous processes should rotate to the right, and they do. Bend to the right, and the spinous processes should rotate to the left. Oops, we've got a problem here. This sideways bending may have been repeated in the thoracic or chest area of your spine. Bending to the left, the spinous processes should rotate to the right, and bending to the right, the spinous processes should move to the left. Again, there's a problem. The lumbar spine, or lower back area, should function a little differently. When you bend to the left, the spinous processes should rotate to the left. And when you bend to the right, the spinous processes should rotate to the right. This area of the spine is not functioning properly either. And while pain or other obvious symptoms may not be associated with this condition, if left uncorrected, there will be nervous system interference and a progressively worsening degeneration process set in motion. These x-ray views of your spine and other examination findings tell your doctor of chiropractic where and how to adjust your spine to restore normal motion and position of individual spinal bones. It also tells your doctor which muscles are not properly supporting the spine and allowing for normal movement. While your spine can be adjusted, to restore normal motion and position, muscles and ligaments supporting the spine may have become accustomed to years of improper support. Often muscles on one side of the spine become strong and the other side become weak. While chiropractic care is appropriate, research suggests this imbalance cannot be corrected by chiropractic adjustments alone. And that's where you come in. You play a critical role in your own recovery by exercising specific muscle groups to overcome this muscle imbalance. When specific exercises or maneuvers are combined with chiropractic adjustments, the spine has its best chance to return to normal. Doing these exercises is like the relationship you have with your dentist. It takes more than regular dental checkups. Brushing and flossing your teeth 
are things you must do to promote dental hygiene and lengthen the life and usefulness of your teeth and gums. Same with your spine. Adjustments alone will not permanently correct your spine. However, when adjustments are combined with proper exercise, dramatic improvement is possible. You can see how effective these exercises are on before and after x-ray views of patients who have worked in partnership with their doctor of chiropractic to improve spinal function. Before treatment, this patient's lumbar spine was restricted and unable to move fully to the left. After treatment, significant functional improvement can be seen. Similarly, before care, this patient's lumbar spine didn't move well to the right. By doing the recommended exercises combined with appropriate chiropractic care, the improvement is remarkable. You will be given specific exercises to do. These exercises take just a few minutes each day and will speed your recovery and help prevent your problem from returning. These exercises have such a profound effect that when subsequent x-ray views of your spine are taken, it'll be quite apparent how consistently you've done them. With this information and the knowledge that you are ultimately responsible for the results you get in this office, you have one of two choices to make. The first is to discontinue your care when your symptoms improve. Symptomatic improvement is possible even without doing your recommended exercises, but it does take longer. Many patients who discontinue care at this stage often find their original complaint returns because supporting muscles have not been retrained and repatterned to a more normal and balanced condition. The other choice is to participate in your health, doing your exercises and looking forward to seeing your functional progress revealed in future x-ray views of your spine. Most of our patients choose this course because their symptoms improve faster it saves them money and helps prevent their problems from returning later. Regardless of your decision, this office is here to support your choice and help you achieve your individual health goals. It's up to you. Your spine is designed to move. When it moves properly, it protects your nervous system and helps you enjoy life to the very fullest.